Special Occasion Speech, Speech Online, Ashley Ling. It is a truth universally acknowledged that a single man in possession of a good fortune must be in want of a wife. I declare, after all, there is no enjoyment like reading. How much sooner one tires of anything than of a book. When I have a house of my own, I shall be miserable if I have not an excellent library. Do these quotes sound familiar to you? Perhaps they will become more familiar as I tell you about the recipient of today's Author Lifetime Achievement Award. She has had an effect on many people over the centuries. Some may say that her books were written only for women, but they can be applicable to men as well. She led an unassuming life in England in the late 1700s and early 1800s, the daughter of a country parson. She had been honing ideas and stories from a very young age, and she and her sister loved going through their father's substantial library. Later in life, she had a chance at love, but lost it. Some say this is the greatest inspiration for all of her love stories, even though she never received the love of a lifetime that all of her main characters did. Her works have been made into highly acclaimed films, and the characters from her most popular work, Pride and Prejudice, are known around the world. Girls fawn over Mr. Darcy and Elizabeth's romance, and instead of waiting for a Mr. Wright, they wait for a Mr. Darcy. All her characters are brilliantly woven into captivating stories about love, loss, and growing up. It is my pleasure to present posthumously this re recipient of the Author Achievement Award, Jane Austen.